for the sake of episode, we gotta hit that episode whip. Welcome to my channel. I'm Ali Fitz and I'm back with another video. And if you're new here, hello, I love you already. Make sure you slap that subscribe button to become part of the Fitz fam today. We pretty lit, it's true. And once you've done that, make sure to follow my social medias over here to stay connected with your girl. And turn on those post notifications so you know all the tea first. Speaking of tea, if y'all did not know, my song When We're Together is now available on all the streaming platforms. So make sure you're buying, streaming, downloading, watching the music video and everything because it is slowly but surely blowing up. And while you're at it, check out the merch at outfits.art because I want you to be wearing all the hottest shit made by your girl. But now that that self promo is finally out of the way, I know you've been waiting for your girl to do some more episode. And don't worry, cause today your dreams are going to be fulfilled. Cause I'm reading another episode story right now. So I was looking through your guys' um, recommendations and I saw one that really just like spoke to me. Because as you can see, the weather is heating up nowadays. Summer is coming. And so this story is called Summer Fever. Shout out to the ones who um, requested this story because like, why not do a summer-ish story since, you know, summer coming? Let me look it up. Oh, let me down, let me download the updated episode. I didn't even know I had to update, oops. Let's read the synopsis. Shout out to Lucas for writing the story. We love Lucas. Show Lucas love, y'all. Welcome to the most luxurious five-star hotel ever. Your package includes sexy lovers, fancy parties, and scandalous drama, and deadly secrets. Ready for a killer summer? Oh wait, is this death and murder stuff? Oh, I'm, I don't know if I'm allowed to say that on here. But anyways, let's get into it. Let's get into it. Oh shoot. I can't believe we're back. This is so crazy. Oh, she hurt. She got a knife. Somebody dead. Oh, I like that this, I like this story already. Not because people are dead, but because I don't usually see this on episode. <laughs> And I also watch horror stuff all the time, so maybe. Summer, what happened? What did you do? Summer, I, I don't know. Summer. So summer fever stands for her. Oh Lord, story by Lucas. Go Lucas, go Lucas. I'm gonna have to drop Lucas a follow. Chapter one, checking in, let's go. I'm excited. One year later, after the killing or whatever happened, I don't know. Are we rich? <laughs> I got lots of questions. Welcome back, Miss Powell. Okay, that's me, Miss Powell. Okay. I'm looking good. It's good to have you back with us. I'm rich. I'm claiming it. We got the limo, private jet. Did you miss being here in Lucky Shores? I miss the sun. Oh. Where was I, in jail or something? <laughs> We're almost there, are you excited? Can we stop by the beach before we get to the hotel? Of course, Miss Powell. Why won't they let me see her face though? I'm scared. She ran fast as hell. <laughs> she wanna see the beach so bad. I miss this view. Okay. Oh, baddie. Oh, that's because we had to customize her. I mean, I feel like I'm gonna leave her because what if we get like the art scenes? I don't know if there's any art scenes in this story, but what if we get that? So I think she looks fine. Let's leave her. And the artist had her in mind. So let's just keep her the same way she is. Damn. <sighs> well, I also miss the hotties. Hey lady, excuse me, could you give me a hand with this? What, me? Yes, you. Do you see anyone else but you and me on this beach? Okay, smart one. Right, it's just us. Okay, so this is Byron. He might be a love interest. Do I wanna customize him? No, I'm, th I'm leaving everybody the way they are. And then I'll pick from the way they look and then maybe customize the one I choose. <laughs> How's that sound? He's good, he's good. So, can you help me with my surfboard? Oh, right, of course. How am I supposed to help? How can I help? I was surfing out there, but one of the fins on my board got caught up in some sticky plastic bag. So I tried to pull it off the fin, but I think it broke. Could you hold it while I check? Should I? All right, let's do this. 
Sure, I'll help any way I can. Thanks, really appreciate it. How should I hold it? Let me show you. Like this. Uh-oh, are we getting a moment? As I'm holding the surfboard, my eyes go rogue and start wandering on the surfer's body. He is very tall, with ripped abs, sinewy arms, did I say that right? Strong legs, has a tattoo on his broad shoulders, dimples for days. It's hard not to stare at such an aesthetically pleasing view, but I know it's impolite. And I'm not one to objectify other people, so I get back to the surfboard. <clears throat> so, how's that? Perfect, thank you. Let's see. Oh, that definitely looks broken to me. Yeah, you're right. Seems like I'll have to buy new ones. Aw. People really need to understand the ocean is not a dumpster, don't you think? Today it was my surfboard, but it could have been a turtle or a dolphin. And he's an environmentalist? Wow. You read my mind. The tourists visiting this city are the worst. You're from here? Do you live in Lucky Shores too? I... Yes. Miss, we're running late. Oh, sorry, I have to go. Wait, wait, I didn't catch your name. Well, it's summer. Bye. <laughs> sorry, Max, I didn't mean to make you late. Don't worry about my father. I'll tell him it was my fault. It's all good, Miss Powell. Your father won't be mad. He is just very excited to see you again. You've been away for more than a year. In jail? That's a long time. Yeah, I know. One year is truly a very long time. What happened? I need the tea. Stat. Power Hotel. I mean, Power... <laughs> Powell Tower. It did not even say hotel, but that's okay. Here we are. The Powell... I can't even say this. The Powell Tower. Welcome home. Whatever this place is, I'm not sure it's home anymore. Thanks for the ride though, Max. Ooh. This looks promising. What? Is this my dad? Summer, my darling daughter. Come here. Yep. Oh, how I've missed you. I've missed you too, dad. And there's my mom. Look at you. You're even more beautiful than you were when you left. How was your time abroad? Do you like Europe? It was great. Did you receive my postcards? Yes, all of them. Did you get to eat at the restaurants I told you about in Paris? How was the food there? Oh, Bonnie, it was not as good as yours, obviously. Oh, Bonnie's not my mom. I miss your restaurant a lot. Bonnie, how about you cook Summer's favorites for lunch? That, oh, yeah, she's the cook. That is a great idea, Mr. Powell. No, don't bother. I'm so jet lagged that I need a nap right now. Are you sure, sweetie? I want you to have everything you desire. Yes, I'm sure. Besides, I still have some snacks in my bag. I'll be fine. I just want to rest a little bit. I get it. All right, like I said, anything you want. Go get some rest, sweetie. We'll catch up later. Sounds good. See you later. Oh, we rich. I love that we just stepped into the rich lifestyle, played this game, instantly rich. Love it. Who's party? Or is this just the hotel? Lobby. Oh, she's shocked. Summer, you're back? Hi, yes, I just got here. How are you? I was perfectly fine until I saw you walk in. Tiana, I know we've had our differences, but I've changed. I want to start fresh with everything and everyone, including you. Oh, and just because the privileged girl has decided to move on, we all have to? You're dangerous, Summer. You deserve to be locked up for what you did last year. What's she do? She's raising her voice. Defend yourself or apologize. Okay, I had a knife. I'm just gonna apologize for everything. I know, I'm sorry. I never meant for any of this to happen. But I would like you to believe me when I say I've changed. The past should be a place of learning, not a place of living. How about we forget the past and move on? Don't touch me, you psychopath. People don't change and you're no exception. Stay away from me. Nothing to see here, ladies and gentlemen. There are free drinks at the pool for the next hour. You don't want to miss this. <laughs> Wait, what did I do? Don't tell me. Thanks, Larry. That was intense. I'm the hotel manager. I was only doing my job. And I'm also doing my job when I ask you to lay low. Damn, what happened? You might be the daughter of the boss, but we run a business here. Uh, keep a low profile? She started it. Damn, don't tell me. She started it. That scene is on her. I wasn't even gonna talk to her. We ran into each other. Look, that's not the problem. I will talk to Tiana, but I want you to stay away from her. We both know why you had to leave last year. We don't want that to happen again. <laughs> Bitch, I can't wait to find out. Or worse, we don't want people to find out about the incident. No, we don't want that. Glad we're on the same page. Welcome back, Summer. 
Oh, I can't wait to find out, y'all. Cause what is this tea? We was stabbing somebody. Okay. Oh, he's cute. Hi, Summer. Are you back in Lucky Shores? I heard you moved to Europe. No, Jeffrey, that was just temporary. I'm back now. Amazing. I mean, I think it's great. That is great. Not just for me. I mean, um, it's great for your father. He must be really happy. <laughs> so should I get your luggage delivered to the Powell suite? Actually, I wasn't planning on staying in my father's suite. Do you have any other room available? We are in high season. I think there's no vacancy. Let me check just in case. Okay, check it out. Oh, you're in luck. One reservation was canceled yesterday. Double room with queen size bed, view in the ocean and private balcony. Oh, the room is on the 10th floor. Should I send your luggage there? Yes, that sounds perfect. Thank you, Jeffrey. Oh, we're so rich, love it. Okay, who, oh, he got a cute. Why is he staring at me? Staring is rude or can I help you? Can I help you? Cause I always got an attitude. Um, excuse me, can I help you with something? Actually, yes, I would love to have your number. Oh, oh wow, <laughs> that was a smooth one. Okay. He might be a love interest. All right, um, he's all right. He's, he's cute, he's cute. What can I say? I'm attracted to beautiful women like a magnet. Too bad I hate magnets. People put on refrigerators like trophies when most of them look awful. <laughs> no refrigerator could ever handle my heat. You can trust me on that. Okay, he's kind of lame. I wonder who that guy is. He seems awfully confident. Yeah, I mean, you could be confident, but he sounds... <laughs> He's not bad looking though, quite the opposite actually. Under that tropical shirt, I notice a tight tank top giving away a hint of what looks like a muscular body. And a smile, no matter how conceited it seems, looks very cute. That guy fits the jock type to me, a man who thinks the whole world belongs to him. Well, this is getting rather weird. Weren't you getting off the elevator? I was until you distracted me. Okay, well I hereby declare the distraction over. Please move. I will see you around, Summer. Willie, how does he know my name? Wait, yeah, cause I didn't say that. Okay, wait, I can't date him. He know too much already. I don't even know him. Hell nah. What's tea? That will do. The place is cute. Oh, I immediately went to sleep. She was jet lagged for real. Oh, she's awake. You deserve to be locked up for what you did last year. What the hell did I do? Let's flash back and figure it out. One year earlier, thank you. So what the hell happened? I was fighting for my life. Damn, why was we fighting? And where did the knife come from? Oh, Summer, what happened? What did you do? What did I do, y'all? And did I deserve to be Taken away? Probably. I don't know what the hell happened. We gonna figure it out though. Summer's back? I can't believe it. This is great news. Yes, I checked her in. She looks beautiful. We haven't seen her since she went on a trip last year. Can't wait to see her again. I can't wait to hear about her travels. Oh, and I can't wait to have her little night outs like old times. Oh, come on, get over her. She's not that special, you know. Tiana, get over yourself. You can't stand not being the center of attention for less than five minutes. This literally is not about me. Summer's nothing but trouble. And you're nothing but jealous. Now shoot, go rain on someone else's parade. <sighs> oh, I'm glad they have my back. What are you guys squabbling about? Tiana was being a hater as usual. Now where were you handsome? We missed you for lunch. I swapped my ship with someone else's. I had to repair my surfboard, long story. Wait, you love your surfboard. Why do you look so cheerful then? Well. I did meet a really pretty girl by the beach. Let me tell you, she was gorgeous. I know it might sound silly, but I want to see her again. Except I don't know her name or her number or anything about her actually. <laughs> That's rather unfortunate, but I am a kind soul and your story touches me, Byron. So I'm willing to help. You're not a kind soul. You're a nosy gossip in the flesh. I'm good. Don't worry. I'll probably never see her again anyway. Oh, Byron, this is so sad. But don't worry, there's plenty of fish in the sea. Good news is you can easily get there with your surfboard. <laughs> Not joking him. Hey, are you guys being paid to chat in the locker room? Oh, sorry, sir, we'll get back to work now. Yes, you will. He's pissed. Y'all better get back to work playing him. Where are we at now? Oh, 
Tiana. Summer's bad. This is intolerable. I can't stay here with her around. I want her gone, and I will do anything I can for that to happen. Huh? You know, I have enough on Summer Powell to send her behind bars. She's going down. I will expose what she did last year. But I'm going to need your help to do that. Are you in? Who's going to expose me? Uh-oh. Let me get ready, because I don't want to get exposed. I'm too cute for that. Who at my door? Who's there? Room service. Oh, I didn't order room service. My dad did, maybe? To be continued. Damn, y'all, episode is back and it is already juicy. Now listen, we're gonna have to work together on this. If you want another episode video this week, I'm gonna need for us to get at least 1,000 likes on this video. So you, if you haven't liked the video yet, like it. If every single one of y'all watching it liked the video, we're gonna get 1,000 likes. And then you'll get another episode to figure out more and more of this story. So far, I like it. My girl had a knife, like, it's real. This ain't a regular, this ain't your regular love triangle episode story. This is something else. But also make sure you check out my music and merch. So have a great day in the name of the Lord and may God bless you every step.